what's going on guys code expert here and we are excited to announce that we are going to develop a new tutorial series this time based on decentralized application for ethereum so let's get started without further ado so let's first understand what decentralized application is so for that just go to ethereum.org and scroll down and just click on many great projects and you will see the projects related to ethereum so basically what decentralized application is is it's a way to communicate with the ethereum blockchain network from the uh, front end server okay so if you just click on the view the top d apps you will see that every project that is built on ethereum is called a d app so basically the deed app has two different components one is front end and another is back end front end is what you see on your browser and back end is what it does actually on the ethereum blockchain so there are different types of uh, ethereum blockchain d applications so you can see this IDEX is decentralized um, exchange, I guess. And there are so many, all of the platforms that are based on Ethereum are called decentralized applications of Ethereum. All right. So if you just uh, want to develop Ethereum based applications, or maybe if you want to go for a startup ICO, then this is the perfect way to do it. So, all right. Um, I hope you understood what decentralized application is and uh, let's get started and now let's understand what are the prerequisites of Ethereum, the uh, decentralized application development. So first one is the solidity and solidity is the language in which Ethereum contracts are developed. Uh, we are not going to cover solidity language here in this tutorial because we already have covered the solidity in another tutorial series and if you are interested you can go to our channel and just go to the playlists and you will see the best ethereum solidity beginner level tutorials here and so we are not going to teach what solidity is we are just going to use it another prerequisites is html and javascript of course because of uh, front end and we are also not going to teach html and javascript in this tutorial we are just going to use html and javascript and the last but not least is you must have a little bit of coding experience because that's what we need for building decentralized application okay so now let's talk about package dependencies uh, the first one is node.js and in almost every system node.js is already installed if not you can go and type brew install npm if you don't know whether it is installed or not then just type node minus v and enter if it gives you the version of node then it means it is already installed all right so my version is already installed i'm not going to install it you can install here or, or you can install in the brew another dependency is truffle framework uh, truffle framework is the package developer package development framework for ethereum to make uh, the development of decentralized application a lot a lot easier and you can install it with npm install truffle minus g minus g is for global installation and i have already installed truffle in my computer so i'm not going to install it but it's very easy to install just type this command uh, on your terminal and hit enter and you will be there 
If it doesn't work, then type sudo before npm. Another dependency is Ganache framework. So this is like a testnet Ethereum. Uh, it enables you to test your Ether developed Ethereum decentralized application without actually putting it on real Ethereum blockchain. Because if you want to test it on real Ethereum blockchain, then you will have to pay a gas fee each time you execute an, uh, uh, a contract and it will not be feasible. So this is the personal testnet, Ethereum testnet, which we are going to use. You can just download it here and it's very easy to install. Just double click once it is downloaded. And I have already downloaded it for Mac OS and uh, it is uh, available in different OS as well. It's not that hard and yeah, so Mac version, yeah, this one is Mac version, Linux as well. Okay. The last dependency that we need is MetaMask. So I have already installed my MetaMask account here and uh, what it does is it allows you it converts your browser into a decentralized browser and it allows you to interact with your testnet which we are going to use in ganache framework here currently we are having we are on the main ethereum network which is a real ethereum network um, but we can change it to custom RPC or local host and change it to a test net which we are going to use for our development. All right, uh, this is not a prerequisite or a dependency, but uh, I'm going to use Intel IJ for the development and text editing but it's up to you which uh, text editor to use it's not mandatory it's there's nothing different uh, to intel ij uh, the only thing i can say about intel ij is it has a plugin for solidity compiling uh, solidity syntax sorry and it makes your life a little bit easier all right so for text, text editing, we are going to use Intel IJ and we are going to use Remix as well, which is like online compiler for the Solidity. So just type Remix Solidity and go to first link, remix.ethereum.org. And here you go. There are some prototype examples here but uh, we are going to develop new files and create our contracts here and then send it back to Intel IJ and develop our decentralized application there. All right, so I think we are good to go now. And yeah, that's it for tutorial. I hope you like this tutorial and we are really excited to go forward and develop our decentralized application i hope that uh, you also are very very um, excited and let's get started i hope you like this tutorial if you like this tutorial then please like it share it and subscribe it because that will motivate me to create more awesome tutorials like this for now take care Bye-bye.